<laughs> What's shaking, everybody? Luke Dancy here, bringing you more all things magic. So if you're a magician, maybe you just really, really, really love magic, you're in the right place. So this week, that's right, guys. This week, I've got something very special for you. This is an exclusive look inside of the Chris Angel Studios right here in Las Vegas. Now, a couple years ago, a local Vegas news channel did a story on Chris's place. He took them around, gave them a tour. Thing is, though, if you don't live in Vegas, you've probably never seen this footage until now. It's pretty crazy to think. I've known Chris for about 15 years now, and I've, I've had a chance to be plugged into this world and see it firsthand a lot. And I thought it'd be really, really fun to give you guys a peek at what goes on behind the scenes, you know, behind the scenes of the, the Mind Freak TV series, the team, the builders, everything that's involved. Probably blow your mind. And after the clip plays, uh, Chris sent me a text message earlier asking me to share some information about something going on in March of this year. Uh, you'll have a chance to own some magic history if you are interested. So stay tuned for that. But right now, here is your look inside of the Chris Angel Studios right here in Las Vegas. Let's do it. This workshop is shrouded in secrecy, home to the secrets of their craft. Uh, yeah, but for the first time, Chris Angel is allowing our cameras into his creative headquarters, and more got Ooh. the exclusive. More is getting more because you are literally the first show to do an in depth look at my facility. Are you ready? Chris Angel opening the gates to his global headquarters for the first time, giving Moore the exclusive first look inside. This is a 60,000 square foot studio. It's a laboratory for all of my crazy visions that I want to bring to life. Whether it's on stage, on television, or online, everything Angel does begins here. If I can think it, we can create it all in-house. Let the never-before-seen tour begin. So, Sean, let me show you inside. I'm going to go in first because you never know what's going on. In here, we have our staging area. This area gives us the ability to, once an illusion is built, to bring it in here, test it out. But this is a big area. You know, this curtain opens up and it has another curtain behind there. It's set up like a real stage. It has a spring floor so that when we have gymnasts here, they won't hurt their joints. I'll even have an audience watch me sometimes. Really? Yeah, absolutely. I'll bring 50 people and they'll sit here and they'll watch. Once we're happy here, then we'll move into a real theater. Next door is the fabrication shop where all of Angel's illusions are built. Doug is a longtime colleague who is an illusionist himself. I brought him on board many, many years ago. So what's great about him is that he not only builds something, but he builds it as a performer. Upstairs is the costume and prop department. Even the smallest details of Angel's shows are taken care of on site. So we have you know, security in the whole complex. That's impressive. Got to keep everything top secret, right? Top secret is the, uh, the key word there. And so this is the production studio where you do a lot of the TV and video elements for all of your productions. Part of it, yeah. We have a 60-foot green screen. We have a bunch of different psychs as well. We have uh, the ability to literally uh, create sets in a moment's notice. With a full team of editors and graphic artists, Angel's team works on state-of-the-art equipment to keep his productions on the cutting edge of magic. Next, we head to Chris's office. The walls here are filled with artifacts showing how his craft has changed and evolved over the years. You know, nothing here is always what it appears to be. I would expect that. Right? So you see all this magic on the shelves and stuff, but could there be a secret passageway. I have a feeling that in this office there is going to be. Behind this secret entrance is Angel's video vault. Every minute of footage he's amassed throughout his entire career is stored here. And God forbid if there was ever a fire, you see that we have a system right over here that will literally extinguish it instantly. I am the so in the shadow of these famous lights is the creative compound where ideas are turned in to illusion. And there you go, guys. Your look right there at the Chris Angel headquarters. Pretty cool stuff, huh? Uh, a lot of moving pieces in there, and that's just a small look at the monster of the machine that is the Chris Angel world. And what's really cool is some of the stuff that you saw in this clip 
It's actually going to be up for auction very, very soon here in Vegas. I've got a link below the video. You click the link below. It'll take you to the page with all the stuff Chris is auctioning off. What's cool about this is Chris has teamed up with Franco Dragon, uh, the guy that created shows like La Rev here in Vegas. And he was one of the pioneers for Cirque du Soleil. They're teaming up on some very exciting projects. So what Chris has done, he's actually cleared out one of his warehouses for production on some of these new shows and projects he's working on. So some of the magic, like the the big, the, the saw that he's, he's going to sell the saw, some of his illusions and magic and all kinds of stuff is up for grabs. So click the link below the video, check it out. Uh, there's some really fun stuff in here uh, that I think you guys might like. Really, you can own a piece of magic history. One of the coolest guys around. And one other quick piece of news for you before I get on out of here. We've got the jam sessions now running every single Wednesday night at 9.30 p.m. Eastern time. We've got information for you coming out on the newsletter every single week. So make sure you sign up at allthingsmagic.com. And we've also been listening to you guys. Listening, listening, listening. Have our ear to the ground. We now have more sizes available for the hoodies. I'm wearing my pullover hoodie now. These were available in just a couple sizes originally. They're now available in small, medium, large, extra large, extra, extra large, and extra, extra, extra large as well. So if you want to get your hands on one of these All Things Magic Pullover hoodies, a link is below the video. Check it out right about now. And, and I'm also told that these zip-up hoodies are coming very soon. There's been a lot of demand for the zip-up. So if you're into those instead of the pullovers, zip-up hoodies are coming very, very soon. Good times today. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, let me know below in the video. Drop a like and hit the subscribe button. Hit the old bell. That way you can find out when there are videos popping up just like this because I am back every week bringing you clips of people performing. I'm bringing you more behind the scenes stuff like this. Some magic products, maybe some interviews coming up soon. All kinds of fun stuff. So all things magic right here. You know where to come. All right, I am out of here. Stay safe, take care of yourself and each other, and I will catch you guys all on the next video. In the meantime, don't forget all the things I talked about in this video are listed below, so click those links, get to where you need to go. That is all for now. Catch you guys next time, all right? I will see you in the next video. <laughs> Bye. I love all things magic.